Aquaba, welcome to Google's AI Research Center here in Ghana's vibrant capital city of Accra. My name is Perry Nelson, and I'm a senior software engineer here at the Research Center. My job sits in the research team, and we're responsible for using AI to create solutions to some of the most pressing challenges facing the continent, from flooding to maternal mortality. Aside from the joys of free lunchtime fufu in our canteen, a typical day for me and the rest of the AI team is usually lots of meetings to discuss the progress of the many projects we're working on. The work we're doing in flood forecasting uses AI to predict when and where riverine floods will occur. Being able to predict flooding provides an early warning system to help people and communities better prepare for these occurrences. Currently, this is available in 23 countries across Africa. For example, our flood hub was able to predict the unfortunate flooding in the Western Cape of South Africa three days in advance. Another really exciting project is the Open Buildings dataset, which maps buildings across Africa using machine learning and satellite imagery. It has already tripled the number of map buildings across Africa, and it's currently being used by multiple organizations to map economic distribution and to support population census planning. In the future, a full rollout of this across Africa will enable better planning of public health and disaster response. Finally, in 2023, we introduced Open Health Stack. This is a suite of tools to help developers build apps for healthcare workers to aid in site-led decision-making. For example, in rural areas, healthcare workers can access population health data to better monitor community health. As well as our group of talented researchers in Accra, we also have researchers in Kenya, where there's another Google office. Kenya is where a lot of our work around maternal health ultrasounds is going on. We're working with a partner named Jacaranda Health to improve ultrasound technology with a focus on using handheld devices that don't have to be connected to larger machines. This can help people who aren't trained in using traditional ultrasound machines to perform ultrasounds. We're also doing some exciting research in food insecurity, which is a huge concern across the continent. I've had the pleasure of working with Dr. Aisha Walcott Bryant, who's the head of research in Google Kenya. Aisha, I'll let you say more about that. Excellent, thank you, Perry. As you and I both know, agriculture is the single most important economic activity in Africa. And our research work seeks to answer two questions. Firstly, in what ways can AI be used to transform Africa's food systems to be resilient to shocks, climate change, and the economy, and changing food needs? And secondly, in what ways can we effectively support stakeholders and local organizations with early warning tools to help vulnerable populations who are at risk of severe food insecurity? I enjoy working alongside African Googlers across the continent to work out how AI can solve everyday problems for Africa and the world. Thanks for visiting the office.